Hey guys, it's Michael here from Happy English. Today, let's take a look at five different ways we use the past modal would have. Remember, the usual pronunciation of would have is woulda. I woulda gone there. I woulda called. I woulda helped you. I woulda done that. First of all, would have means you wanted to do something, but you were unable to do it. In these situations, we often use would have and but. I would have blah, 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 but blah, blah, blah. I would have called you, but I was busy in the office. I would have called you. I would have gone to the beach, but it started raining. I would have gone there. I would have helped you move. Why didn't you let me know you needed help? I would have helped you. You can also use I would have when you find out that something was possible to do, but you didn't know about it at the time. So you didn't do it. The nuance is an unstated condition. If I had known about that thing, I would have done it. Quite often in conversational English, the if clause is not stated. Hey, I didn't know they offered free dessert in this restaurant. I would have ordered something. There was a free concert last night in the park. I was free last night. I would have gone. Ah, oh, I can't believe there was a comedy special on last night. I would have watched it. We also use the phrase, I would like to have, to show regret or disappointment that we didn't do something. I would like to have seen that movie in the theater, but I missed my chance. <laughs> Jenny is a nice girl. I would like to have gotten to know her better before she moved to Miami. That was a really interesting lecture. I would like to have asked the speaker a couple of questions if there was time. We use I would rather have to show that we are not happy with a choice that we've made. I would rather have shows that you wish you had done something different. The pasta was good last night, but I would rather have had sushi. My wife enjoyed the musical, but I would rather have gone to a jazz club. That bargain sale at the department store wasn't very good. I would rather have stayed home. And finally, we use I never would have guessed, followed by a sentence, to mean, I'm surprised about that thing. You can use, I never would have guessed that, or just, I never would have guessed. I saw Greg at the opera the other day. I never would have guessed he likes that kind of music. Wow, you're eating green curry? I never would have guessed that you like spicy food. I was so surprised when Danny started singing at karaoke last night. I never would have guessed he's such a great singer. Well, I never would have guessed that you stayed till the end of this video. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Remember to leave your comment, and I'll catch you guys next time right here at Happy English. Catch you later.